as the All Progressive Congress APC plans to amend its constitution. The Minister of Women Affairs, then Pauline Tallinn, has demanded that women should be given equal access to contest elections at the party level. Then Pauline Tallinn stated these at the All Progressive Congress National Headquarters in Abuja when she led a high powered women group on a courtesy call to the Chairman APC Constitution Review Committee. The minister said that Nigeria leads in every aspect as a giant of Africa, except in the aspect of women participation in politics. She further went to say that they are appealing for, among other things, gender equality and women empowerment, improved women participation in politics, devoting at least 25% of the APC annual budget to increase participation of women in politics, and also a 50-50 equal representation of women and men from the world level to the national level level and demanding for affirmative action in the party structure. We want the party to demonstrate political willingness and commitment to gender equality and women's empowerment. We are appealing and calling for the improvement of women's participation in politics and decision making. That can be done through institutionalization of justice and fairness for men and women within the party and its framework. Creating an organ within the party to monitor and evaluate the implications of party policy and practice for both men and women. Strengthening the office of the woman leader to serve as the focal point for implementation of gender issues, issues within the party. Adequate and guaranteed access to funding human and technical resources to carry out responsibilities of the party. Devoting at least 25% of the party's annual budget of the party to, deliver, to the delivery of increased participation of women. To take conscious action in party structure and elections so as to ensure that no gender constitutes more than 60% from the world to the national level. To ensure that no gender constitutes more than 60, I repeat that, of delegates and candidates in the final list after primaries. We are demanding for 50-50 equal representation at the world level <laughs> to the national level. Responding on behalf of the committee, the chairman, Professor Tahir Maman, appreciated the minister and our entourage for being proactive as they are the first group to submit their request to the committee. He said that women group and other interest group will be given special consideration. He, however, urged the women to continue lobbying with other uh, with the National Assembly, critical stakeholders of the party and the party executives, as the committee cannot assent to all their plight. In addition to what you are submitting and our own thoughts, you have somebody there who will ensure that uh, the right thing goes through all the processes. And this is the first time uh, we are receiving submissions from an interest group. So I am not surprised that it is coming from you. I am not surprised at all that it is coming from the women. Uh, it, it shows how uh, committed you are to this cause. It shows how agitated you are in respect of this cause. And uh, it's not going to, uh, it has left a lot of impressions on us. In fact, I remember the first time we met, uh, you came to me, to my office, when this idea was even mooted, it was not even inaugurated at that time. You took that initial first step, you know, to submit, and that's even what we had here. And I'll just to tell you how to remind that house. The Raj of the Women Affairs Minister, where Honorable Aisha Duku, member representing Nafada Duku Federal Constituency, Hajia Hajosani, special advisor to the wife of the president, Ms. Comfort Lamte, UN country representative, former women leaders of the party, among others. The high point of the event is the presentation of a copy of the demand to the chairman of the party. 
the high point of the event is the present the high point of the event is the presentation of a copy of the demand to the chairman of the committee by the minister of women affairs them Pauline Tallinn. in abuja shamsuddin abdrazak i media news